Hello guys, welcome to Game Art. This is uh, Harun here. So um, this is very quick tutorial uh, in which uh, we're gonna figure out how to save our C drive uh, from uh, losing lots of uh, your uh, no, SSD, your um, C drive uh, space. Uh, so um, it's what I um, felt is when I uh, working on the Unreal projects uh, I noticed that I was losing a lot of uh, disk space from the C drive and my PC going to really really slow so um, I figured out uh, some um, um, you know small uh, steps uh, which is very important actually so I think it gonna help you guys very well uh, if you like the video please don't forget to subscribe this channel and share to your friends who are suffering this problem so okay um i will show you what's actually uh, happened to me so actually in my c drive it was uh, if you don't believe it was like around uh, 100 mb free only so now i got around 100 gb free for my c drive and my pc is uh, reasonably faster so i will show you what i did okay so um so i have few gbs in my e drive and i installed uh, all my uh, project unreal projects in the e drive but even though i um, uh, install projects in the e drive my c drive is getting uh, every time is getting uh, losing the space so i was wondering why it's happening like that so first thing is that when you open your epic game launcher you have to make sure in your settings uh, there is something called uh, edit all cake locations here so uh, before uh, you you have to make sure it is in your um, uh, drive where you have a space okay maybe in it by default it will be in your c drive so make sure that uh, if this uh, location is fine i mean uh, where you have a drive space so make sure you, the link uh, is the correct one Otherwise, what will happen is whenever you have, uh, whenever you download uh, anything from your wallet or anything from the marketplace, it will go to. So I have so many things in my marketplace uh, in wallet. So each time if I add to project, if I download, there will be like a few GBs. Um, so I'll show you um, where I saved. Um, one second, um, just hold on. So uh, not here. I saved in Unreal Engine. Yeah, it's I create another folder here. It's called Wall Cake, and all my downloaded marketplace um, contents are here. So if you right and click, you can see it's around see around um, 69 GBs, around 70 GBs. So make sure that Wall Cake location is in uh, your uh, proper drive. Otherwise, you will be losing uh, your C drive space okay that's one thing one thing is uh, okay you i'll show you one more time it is in uh, it is in the edit wall location okay that's one thing and next one uh, we need to open any project uh, let me open a project and i will show you so all right so um, next step is uh, what you have to do for saving your c drive space is that so um it the unreal will, uh, will uh, you know store lots of uh, you know compiled shaders in your c drive by default so every time you open any project or something there will be lots of um, internal files some compiling shader files or something related to that project will be saved into your c drive so how to find that is when you go to your c drive uh it's c in the c drive users and your name and right now it's admin uh so um, there is something called app data and local and your unreal engine or is unreal engine it's unreal engine here so there was a um, before here i was i was getting a lot of files even the common right now the common file there were cake and you know you, you can see all these files um you can check the properties there's few mbs right now before there was like um, many files in this folder you know local drive there will around um, i have around 35 gbs or something here then i cleaned all these things so now um, in your folder you go to this location see user your name or admin app data local and real engine and make sure 
uh, see if you, there is a, how many files are there in this folder and you just have to delete this one well you can delete this called uh, you know ddc files something called uh, what's a derived data cake and something called uh, uh, shared uh, shared or derived data cake so some the, there are like a two uh, ddc files one is local ddc and uh, shader ddc ddc means derived data cake files so you can delete that one so even if you delete uh, uh, you just have to uh, you know recombine the shaders that's not a problem you can even delete uh, they make sure your under is closed and you can delete right now I deleted and uh, before this uh, before making this video so that's the thing and when you come to your project settings uh, not project setting your edit preference uh, and then you can go to the global and you can change the location here make sure before there was uh, make sure is there in a location if there is no location then you have to put the location where you have uh, space in your your drive okay so i made a i made a before it was in the c drive in the local i mean the users admin you know app data like that it was there and then i changed the path uh, this uh, local derived data cake location and shared derived derived data cake locations these two you have to make sure you have proper location so um i did, what i did is like in the e drive i um, create uh, create uh, unreal engine ddc folder here and i created two groups two folder one is ldc that is our local derived data cake folder and the sddc that is our sh shader derived data cake folder so and then keep the link here so this folder links are here one is this one and second one is this one so and you just save that one as a default so every time when you create any project or anything this all the file will go to that particular folder this all uh, you know uh, derived data kick files will go that folder so you will save a lot of files a lot of space in your C drive so these are the main two steps one is the wall cake location you have to change from the um, you know the launcher and your global settings go to the preference settings and global and change these uh, DDC uh, locations here so and then save as a default so then you will uh, save a lot of file a lot of space in your d drive i think uh, uh, this is this is how i saved uh, my c drive so i i think uh, it helped you guys a lot or uh, if you think this uh, video is very helpful then please don't forget to sh subscribe this channel and share to your friends see you next time bye bye